Are you ready for a change and thinking of moving to Florida, but you just aren't sure what city is right for you? If South Florida caught your attention, let me introduce you to one of my favorite cities, West Palm Beach. West Palm Beach is a booming coastal city that's located in the heart of Palm Beach County and one of the top locations that people just like you are moving to every single day. For those of you that are hesitant, trust me when I say this, this place has it all. From rich history and diverse culture to world-class shopping and top-notch restaurants for foodies, West Palm Beach definitely has something for everyone. And let's not forget about outdoor activities. So whether you're a beach lover or a golf fanatic, West Palm Beach has got you covered. So put on your shades and join me on this tour where I'll show you everything West Palm Beach has to offer and I promise to do it in just 10 minutes because let's face it, you don't have all day. Before we start the clock, if this is your first time to the channel and you wanna know everything you can about living in South Florida, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and tap that bell so you're notified whenever I drop a new video about what life is like here in South Florida. For those new to live South Florida, my name is Jonathan and my real estate team and I, we get calls, texts, emails, every single day from people that are just like you who are looking to make their move to or around South Florida and we love it so whether you're looking to make a move next week next month or even next year feel free to give us a call send us a text or an email and we're happy to help you make your best move yet be sure to check out the description below here we go Alexa start a 10 minute timer 10 minutes starting now West Palm Beach is a major city located in the southeastern part of Florida along the Atlantic Ocean. The population is over 122,000 people as of 2023, making it the largest city in Palm Beach County and the 17th largest in all of Florida. It's actually also the oldest incorporated municipality in all of South Florida. It's even older than Miami, and it was once home to railroad tycoon Henry Flagler. West Palm is ideally located less than an hour north of Fort Lauderdale and south of Port St. Lucie. If you enjoy exploring in our someone that likes taking day trips or staycation. Miami is only an hour and a half south and Orlando is just two and a half hours north, which makes it really easy to take the family to Disney World. It's also just west of the famous Palm Beach Island, which is home to the ultra wealthy. Over 50 billionaires live on the island like Donald Trump, Robert Kraft, Stephen Ross, but we'll save all of that for another video. Obviously, people have been flocking here even before the pandemic in 2020, trading in snow for warm weather, beautiful beaches, and a healthy economy with less taxes. For many of those reasons, West Palm Beach has grown by 4.5% since 2020, and it continues to do so. According to a study conducted by Unicast, Palm Beach County was the second most moved to county in Florida in 2022, only behind Tampa's Lee County. A whopping 41% of all of those migrants here came from New York, not counting all the other states from the Northeast, which would drive that percentage even higher. So don't be surprised to hear plenty of Northern accents here and complaints about the pizza, but don't worry, I'll tell you where to find a good slice. The city of West Palm Beach has also ranked as one of the top places to live and travel to in recent years by Forbes Magazine, Livability.com, and Fodars. It's also one of the most diverse cities in Florida, so you'll get a lot of flavor without the chaos of cities like Miami. Speaking of living here, let's get right into real estate. The West Palm Beach real estate market has been appreciating over the past few years, but there are certainly areas here that tend to be more affordable in comparison to other locations in South Florida. The city offers a variety of home options like condos, townhomes, single family homes, historic homes, luxury properties, and even retirement and golf communities. West Palm Beach is an excellent place to invest in real estate and has seen a huge revitalization over the past decades from residential development projects to commercial properties. There are also specific locations to find duplexes, triplexes, and other multifamily housing opportunities. Another thing you should know is that the city also allows Airbnb type daily rentals, and it's not as strict as cities such as Boca Raton or locations in Miami where Airbnbs are illegal. So West Palm Beach is currently more investor friendly too. Many people that relocate here from up north or from other parts of the country notice that many communities here are planned gated neighborhoods with HOA and often inquire about more charming homes with that northern feel. If you're one of those individuals there's plenty of districts near downtown West Palm with historic homes in all different styles like Mediterranean Spanish Revival such as El Cid Old Northwood Flamingo Park Prospect Park and the South and neighborhood which I personally love if newer homes in a suburban setting is more your taste there are plenty of options that are west of 95 closer to the turnpike another thing some people don't realize is the difference in living east or west of I-95 the area east of I-95 is close to downtown and the beach it's more densely populated with high-rise buildings and condos and it's more diverse than living west of I-95. There's a higher concentration of young professionals, retirees, tourists, and seasonal residents out east
east while the western area is home to more families and long-term residents. You'll find that west of I-95 is generally more residential with single family homes and townhomes. Okay, so let's get into the fun part, things to do here. West Palm Beach is filled with a variety of attractions other than its amazing beaches. There's plenty of indoor and outdoor activities and events for people of all ages. From the historic Flagler Museum to walking around popular areas like the Square and Clamata Street, there are endless opportunities for exploration. If you're looking for a great meal, West Palm is an excellent foodie destination and home to some of the best restaurants in the state. My personal favorites are the historic Okeechobee Steakhouse, Bukan, which is an award-winning restaurant on Palm Beach Island, City Cellar located at the Square, the scenic rooftop restaurant at Restoration Hardware, Rocco's Tacos for Chips and Guac, Table 26, and Avocado Grill. There's really so many to choose from, and even an industrial style food hall called Grandview Public Market. If you're looking for a good slice of pizza, City Pizza is a popular spot nearby. And if you like fancy artisan style pizza with truffle or honey, try Galley, which is located at the Hilton, or Elizabetta's, which is downtown. West Palm is also one of the top cities for vegans in South Florida, so if you're gone plant-based, there's no shortage of restaurants here like True Food Kitchen, Planta, and Pura Vida. The city, of course, also has a range of bars and clubs, from dive bars to upscale lounges along Clamata Street. Now, the clubbing scene is not as abundant here as Miami or Fort Lauderdale, but there is plenty of action for a fun night out on the town. Even trendy rooftop bars like Spruzo, located at the Ben Hotel, which is a must visit and a perfect spot for cocktails with incredible views. If you love shopping, West Palm will not disappoint. Popular shopping destinations destinations here include the Antique Row District, the Northwood Village Shopping Center, and the Clamata Street District. All of these areas offer unique shopping experiences with a variety of specialty stores and galleries. Tanger Outlet is also nearby and you're roughly a 30 minute drive from two of the most luxurious malls in the county, Town Center Mall in Boca Raton or the Gardens Mall in Palm Beach Gardens. The island of Palm Beach is also known for its high-end shops, restaurants, landmarks like the Breakers Resort, and of course its beautiful oceanfront views and pristine landscaping. So what's there for families to do? Well, West Palm offers a wide range of family and cultural institutions, including the Norton Museum of Art, the Kravis Center for the Performing Arts, the Palm Beach Zoo, and the Cox Science Museum. As I mentioned earlier, a popular attraction in West Palm Beach is the Flagler Museum. This museum is housed in the former home of railroad and oil tycoon Henry Flagler and is a great place to learn about the city's history and architecture. The city is also home to a variety of cultural events and festivals, the annual Sunfest Music Festival and Palm Beach International Film Festival, boat shows, holiday events. These are just a few of the many things that take place here. For those looking to explore the outdoors, West Palm Beach has a variety of parks and trails. The Grassy Waters Nature Preserve is a great place to explore the area's natural beauty, while the nearby Okahili Park offers a range of recreational activities, including fishing, boating, biking, and even golf. Palm Beach in general has some of the best golf courses in South Florida, like Trump International, and is even home to Drive Shack, which is a modern golf venue located near Grand View market. You'll also notice that West Palm Beach has a thriving running, biking, and fitness community with many local races. Okay, so now onto the more serious stuff like the job market. I have great news. The job market here is really strong with a low unemployment rate. Lots of demand for skilled workers and not having a state income tax is a perk for those relocating here from high tax states like New York, New Jersey, and California. And there are some really hot fields right now, like healthcare, aerospace, technology, and finance. And we've got some major players in the job market. Tenant Healthcare is a big employer here, as well as Pratt & Whitney, which is one of the top aerospace companies in the world. And they've got a huge presence in West Palm Beach. Then there's the Scripps Research Institute, which is a nonprofit that's doing some amazing work in the biomedical research field. And let's not forget about Next Era Energy, which is one of the biggest clean energy companies on the planet that's doing some really cool things to help protect the environment. Florida Crystals is another one, a domestic producer of organic sugar. And of course, we have the JFK Medical Center, the Palm Beach County School District, and the city of West Palm Beach that employs thousands here. But it's not just the big companies that are making waves in West Palm Beach. There are also tons of small and medium-sized businesses in the area, which means there are a lot of opportunities for all kinds of careers such as real estate, finance, hospitality, and agriculture too. 
Okay, let's move on to the education in schools in West Palm Beach. Whether you're looking for a public school with a strong academic focus or a private school with a specialized curriculum, West Palm Beach has plenty of options to choose from. The school district offers a variety of educational programs and services, including gifted and talented programs, special education, and adult education. The district also has a number of magnet schools, which are specialized schools that focus on specific areas such as the arts, STEM, and international studies. Aside from the public school system, West Palm Beach also has a number of private schools offering educational programs from Montessori and Waldorf programs to college preparatory curriculums. West Palm Beach also has several art schools. The Alexander Dreyfus Junior School of the Arts is a public high school that offers a rigorous academic program along with intensive training in the arts. The school offers programs in dance, music, theater, and visual arts, and it's consistently ranked as one of the top art schools in the country. The city is also home to a number of university campuses including Palm Beach Atlantic University, a Florida Atlantic University campus, and the Palm Beach State College campus. The main campuses of FAU, PBSC, and Lynn are located in the nearby city of Boca Raton, which is about a 30 minute drive, making it an easy commute. Okay, let's talk about healthcare. West Palm Beach is home to several world-class hospitals, including the West Palm Beach VA Medical Center, Good Samaritan, the highly ranked Jupiter Medical Center, and JFK Medical Center, St. Mary's Hospital, and also Palm Beach Gardens Medical Center, which is nearby. With a score of 87.74 out of 100, Jupiter Medical Center, which happens to be in West Palm Beach, is ranked as a top hospital in the West Palm Beach area. According to the US News & World Report, overall, West Palm Beach's healthcare industry is highly regarded and provides residents with access to quality medical care so that's it Alexa turn the timer off everything you need to know about West Palm Beach in 10 minutes if you found this information helpful hit the like button and if you want to learn about other cities in just 10 minutes make sure to go watch this video